my name is Gemma and on this video I will show you how to change the DRL on an X-Gen Scania. First you need to unclip the casing that is just inside the door and undo the two spring-loaded screws. All the tools you need will be found in the Scania toolkit although for this video I have used some of my own. You will also need to undo the other two spring-loaded screws on the other side of the light just under the grille. Then you will be able to swing the light round so you can get to the back. Then you need to remove the white plastic outer casing. This proved quite challenging as this truck is just over a year old and already some of the screw casings had already cracked. This meant that I couldn't get some of the screws out but I managed to get enough out so that I could just prise back the white outer casing and do what I needed to do. Next I needed to remove this metal mounting and that had four screws in it. I then needed to take the screws out of this black plastic attachment and disconnect them. I could then unscrew and remove the piece of metal that the circuit board was mounted on and unplug the plug and play connection. I could then unscrew the horn and remove the old circuit board. The four yellow squares are what emits the light down the horn. Every how-to guide I have read has recommended that you spread some thermal grease between the circuit board and the mounting plate. I also asked the Scania technician what they do and they also use thermal grease when refitting. However, Scania don't use thermal grease in the initial build. I then needed to put it all back together. The horn needed to be placed delicately around the clear tube so that the light could emit through it. Then it just all needed to be put back together. Most of the information I read about how to do this said it would take about half an hour per side. It probably took me about an hour, but the second side was a lot quicker than the first. 